to my channel. It's Brittany if you're new here. It is pretty early. It's about 7.30 here. Um, my son is finally feeling so much better. No more throw up. He's done solid poop. So sorry if that's too much info, but I'm just super happy. Um, so yeah, we're just getting ready to run out right now. We're going to go do some errands. I'm heading to Walmart. Um, I need to go return something. And then I'm going to start getting some baking goods. I'm going to start practicing baking some treats for my son's first birthday. So his birthday is this Sunday, but I'm having his party the following week. So I'm just really trying to get everything together, all the finishing touches. So I'm going to go there and get some stuff. And then I'll show you guys what we get. to make for his party that I'm going to experiment with. You stuck? Come here. All right, so I'm making like Rice Krispie treats and with these candy melts, I'm going to melt them and then dip the end of the Rice Krispie treat and then put little, um, these edible monster eyeballs on that. I saw it, saw it on Pinterest, so I'm going to practice today with a couple and I'll show you guys um, how those turn out and then I got some cute little like they have like little monster eyeballs so I think I'm gonna do like a little photo booth thing or something so people can take pictures with so I'll use this one the eyeball the boom probably the little Frankenstein one the other ones are like Halloween ones so I won't use those for his party and then I have like little masks and stuff and then, yeah, I got these little suckers for like party favors I'm gonna do for the kiddos. And then I thought this would be really fun. These are like multicolor lights I'm gonna put on like the dessert table to just add a little pop of that. They're battery operated. Um, so I thought that'd be fun. So I got a couple of those and then I'll reuse those for parties in the future. And then I think I'm gonna redo my outside area and make it more Halloween. It's just fall outside. So now that it's Halloween, so I got this cute little sign from Walmart. And then I got this cute little skeleton um, tablecloth to put in my kitchen. So I'll show you guys that when I put that up. Are you stuck again? Okay, I'll come get you. All right, so I just put my son down for his nap. Um, so I want to show you guys what I got for his birthday so far as decor wise. So. This is one of my favorite things because what I'm going to do, so look at, so basically I'm printing out pictures of him from each month. So there goes newborn, one month, and then it's so cute. It has this like little pin in the back and then um, it comes with like this ribbon. Um, so I'll just pin that all onto here and then I'll just put like pictures of him. So I'm going to hang that up on a wall, but I got this, um, on an Etsy site so I can link down her site down below um, if you guys are having a party or throwing a party anytime soon um, she does not only the monster theme she does all these different themes um, so I'll link that down below but I thought that was so cute it's like a little chalkboard and a little monster theme so that's one of the decor items like literally every day you guys I've had packages come to my door Okay, so this is what he's gonna wear for his birthday. Um, it's just this cute little onesie. It just says, this little monster is one. And then it says his name on it. And then I'm just gonna have him wear jeans or something. So I got this size 18 months, so hopefully that should fit. It might be a little big for him, but just wanted to have it. I'd rather have it a little bigger than too small. So I have that that he's gonna wear. And then these are some of the centerpieces 
what I'm going to do. Um, so this is from the same lady, basically. Um, so yeah, this one says, happy birthday, Bryce. Our little monster is one. Happy birthday, Bryce, again. So I'm going to put them, because as you can see, they're kind of like flowers. Um, so I'm going to get like a little like bin um, to put these in. And then in the front, I might put like a picture of him as well, or like put some of those little twinkling lights that I showed you. So I don't know, I'm gonna mess with that and kind of see what I can come up with. But I thought those were cute. So I got those for like the tables. And then, so this one is another decor piece. I haven't opened it yet. So I got it all set up, so I thought it would be easier if I laid it out. But look how stinking cute this is. It says little monster. And then the letters are like a light blue. And then the little orange monster. So I figured I would hang that up on one of the walls. Maybe I'll put this above like the gift, the gift table for him. Um, and then I still need to find like a backdrop to do for the little photo booth I want to do. Um, and then I'll show you guys his little, um, banner that I'm going to put on his high chair too. I think I've showed you that in a previous video, but I'll show you guys again so you can see. All right. And then this one's going to go in his high chair. Look how cute that is too. I got this off an Etsy stop shop as well. Everything, a lot of it's from Etsy. Um, but yeah, just with all the blues, greens, and yellows. And I love the little monster. It'll match his shirt. So yeah, that will go on his high chair. Um, and then I'll show you guys the little props I'm gonna put on the tables as well. So then also like on the tables, I'm gonna put like these little monster little puffs. I got these from Michael's. Um, and a couple of these little monster puffs. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna kinda like scatter that all around the tables. And then, oh yeah, I got some cute little Halloween bubbles for the kids for like their party favors. Um, or I might have these out for them to play with. I'm still kind of debating. Maybe I'll have these out for them to do outside. And then I ordered like a ball pit thing for them to play with, a little kitty section I'm gonna do for them. And then I got these like little eyeballs to put in there goodie bags so I think I'm gonna head over to Michael's again today and just see if they have any more because I went like a month ago when they were just first starting to get stuff out um so I'm hoping they have more stuff so I'm gonna go to Michael's and then I need to return Bryce's Halloween costume still because it's too big and then I need to order um his Halloween costume online um and then I just need to get like tablecloths for all the tables sorry that beeping's my son's monitor it's dying um what else um but yeah i think that's pretty much it just and then figure out a backdrop and then oh yeah here's the little other little mask i got too like for the little photo booth um collage so thought that'd be fun um but yeah that's pretty much it everything else um like the food we're doing a taco truck like i said so that will be really yummy um and then we'll have a dessert table so we're gonna do the smash cake for him, cupcakes for everyone else, and then other little treats I'm gonna make. So I'll show you guys that. But um, yeah, so I'm just gonna go get ready for the day real fast since my son's down. And then once he wakes up, we're gonna go to Michael's. Um, so yeah, we'll see you in a little bit. All right, you guys, I got all ready to go. I changed because now it's hotter. Little guys in the back. So we're gonna go ahead to Michael's right now and see what we can find. Um, for his birthday and I might get a couple more things um because I'm kind of revamping the outside of my house for Halloween so let's sorry, go guys. sorry I didn't vlog when we were in Michael's and then I ended up going to Walmart and I got a few more things um to revamp my house so um my son was being kind of complicated so I had to distract him but I figured I would show you guys real quick I just put him down for a nap not too long ago but I don't know if he's gonna nap he's kind of fighting it so I'm gonna do this real quick so as you can see this is one of my new little friends so I think I'm gonna put him in my little garden area where I have the scarecrow so now I'm gonna make that like a haunted like scarecrow like type of thing so I'm just gonna add some 
spooky pieces. So I got that one. Um, or I got two. So I figured I have um, two little skeletons that I'll put in there. And then I got this little black cat and then this black pumpkin. So I'm gonna like revamp my um, doorway too. And then I got this cute little pumpkin. Love that. And then this pumpkin. And this is all from Walmart, by the way. Um, they had really good deals, so couldn't pass those up. And then I got these three um, little baby ones that kind of match all those. And then, um, oh yeah, I got these stickers. Um, that I need to put on my window, like more little window sticker things that I'll put in my kitchen. And then I got like a ton of spider webs that I'm gonna put in the planter where the scarecrows are too. So I just got like a ton of these. And then I found these two creepy spiders. Like look how creepy these are you guys. Josh is gonna be like what the heck when he gets home because he's out of town right now. So I'm literally like gonna make it all spooky. But yeah, I got two of these, and then I figured I could do, um, I got these little baby spiders too. They look kind of real. So I'm going to put those all over in the spider webs. And then I just got more like creepy cloth I'm going to put on um, by my windows outside. And then, oh, I got another strobe light thing um, to put on at night. And then I got all these little baby little skeletons that I'm gonna throw in there as well. Um, oh yeah, and then the only thing for Michaels I got were these um, like confetti, like little fillers that I'm gonna do with the centerpieces. I'm gonna get like little buckets, throw this in there, and then stick the little um, centerpieces in the middle to fill that. So that's all I got for Michaels. I got one more thing, I can't, I don't remember right now. But anyways, so yeah, that's what I ended up getting at Walmart. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to end the vlog here, you guys. I'm hoping my son goes down because I'm really going to try to film this while he's napping um, of me decorating. So look out for that video. Hopefully I can get that up for you tomorrow or the next day. We'll see. Um, so yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, you guys.